What I enjoy most about my job is the ability to go out and uh, support the guys on the ground every single day. Um, throughout my career, I've been able to go out and support troops on the ground all across the globe, and uh, it's the most fulfilling thing to me. The UH-1Y uh, Huey has a uh, multitude of capabilities uh, at its disposal. Um, we've got the uh, two crew chief door gunners in the back, and also we've got the uh, pilots in the front and the Bright Star Block 2 sensor off the front. So uh, with that, we're able to integrate the between our eyeballs, our night vision sensors, and also the FLIR sensor off the uh, front. And we're able to collect information all over the battlefield, uh, track targets, and destroy them as necessary. The Huey's lethality spurs us directly from the crew that main uh, maintains it, and flies it, and fights it. Uh, the uh, door gunners in the back um, have uh, the 50 cal uh, that fires 1,100 rounds per minute, and also they've got the GAL-17, which fires 3,000 rounds per minute. Uh, as far as the uh, pilots in the front, we've got uh, high explosive rocket warheads, push at rocket warheads, uh, cap marking capabilities, and also advanced precision kill weapons and some uh, laser guided rockets. Um, from that, we're able to engage targets all the way out to three miles away from the helicopter, all the way into the feet. Between the Huey and Cobra, we're able to uh, accomplish the multitude of missions that First Maw has on its table in the PACOM AOR. We're able to go down and uh, support humanitarian assistance, disaster relief. Uh, if it ever calls, or we're able to go out and conduct offensive air support and uh, support the ground forces if uh, we're ever called to fight.